Hi everyone, my name is Francesca Ferrando. I'm a professor here at NYU Program on Liberal Studies and I am a philosopher of the posthuman. Here I'm going to address very specific concepts, specifically in this video, the concept of post-human. Are we already post-human? Two answers, yes and no, depending on the philosophical movements we are thinking of. According to transhumanism, we are not post-human yet. We were humans, some of us are transhuman, emerging more and more with technology, in seeing the human as an open notion, and some in the close future may become post-human, for instance, with the example of mind uploading, in which we have uh, the uh, speculative technology of uh, uh, downloading human consciousness in a machine, that hybrid, that uh, co-emerge human consciousness and a machinic element cannot be considered human anymore because humans do have biological bodies, but it's also related to human, for instance, from the aspect of consciousness. Another example, post-humanities, humans migrating to Mars and uh, not merging, uh, not procreating anymore with humans living on planet Earth, eventually, generation after generations, these humans who migrated on Mars may develop into a different species, which is connected to the human species, but is not human anymore. So the answer to this question, are we already post-human? The answer is no, according to transhumanism. We were human, we are now transhuman, and some of us in the close future may become post-human. The answer is yes, according to post-humanism. So yes, we can already be post-human in the way we address existence. So the post-human here is seen as a philosophy of existence, the way we live. And again, it would be to the, to the deconstruction of the notion of the human, seen as, as an open, uh, is an open frame, is existing not anymore enclosed by a cultural, biological, historical notion that is the human. So, according to post-humanism, you can be post-human now in the way you live, in the way you exist, in the way you relate to yourself in relation to others. Uh, through the deconstruction of the human done as a post-slash-humanism, as a post-slash-anthropocentrism, and as a post-slash-dualism. Thank you so much for your kind attention. More information on my website, theposthuman.org.